I think what I love most about my work is working with people. I love working with small business owners because they, they are each individual uh, personalities and each business is unique. In terms of corporate America, I love exploring and, and learning how the corporate America operates. I think what I've learned as a news anchor and as a news reporter is what my clients respect and value the most because I've been in front and behind the camera. So I know both of the ends and I know how to coach people on camera and how to help them deliver the right message in a very concise and short time. Because you know, if you work, when you work in the news department, all the breaking news come in throughout the day and you have to think really fast to be able to edit that in your mind and to then tell the story or tell the news on camera to, to the viewers. So when I'm shooting my videos, or when I work with my clients, what I do, I listen to them and I already edit everything in my mind. I, I sort of know what pieces will go together. That specifically applies, applies to interview style of videos where I interview people and I know exactly what, what kind of questions I need to ask and based on their answers, I know where those answers are going to fit, to fit in the whole story. I think what my clients like most about me is that my turnaround is very quick. I deliver projects sooner than I promise, and uh, that is very important in fast turnaround type of uh, requests. What my clients also appreciate is uh, that I also give spontaneous feedback while I'm filming them. We film the message, I record everything, but at the same time I listen, and if there is anything that my client uh, misses in their messaging, I say right there, right now. How do videos help my clients? I think that first of all, it draws traffic to their website. It builds awareness about their services or their products. And uh, it builds relationship with their potential customers or partners or, um, or people who buy their services. I see it as, a, um, as an icebreaker type of thing because um, you get to know the personality. You get to know their body language. You get to know how they talk. Or uh, do they have a sense of humor maybe? Do they smile or are they stiff and, and always, you know, strict looking? So it, that the video helps with figuring out a little bit more about the person before you go in and meet them in, the, in their office. Of course, there's a whole video marketing campaign that people can do from homepage video to, you know, video blogging to providing various, various tips about how to use the products that you're releasing in your company so that people who are going to buy those products will know what to expect or let's say partners, company partners who are going to buy your services or your tools are going to know how to implement them within their systems. So it's a whole video marketing campaign that a company or a business can do that would help them with the traffic and with awareness about the company. Corporate needs and startup needs are completely different from small business owners' needs. And that is, that's what makes my job interesting because I get to explore both sides. I think where I open up the most as a producer, as a former journalist, are the event projects because event videos in itself are very challenging to produce so that they're fun to watch. Usually when clients approach me and tell me, we are doing an event, can you come in and shoot our event? My first question is, what do you want out of that event? And what is the purpose of the video, of the final product? And usually they don't, they don't have the answer. They just want to shoot the event. That's where I come in. I provide them with multiple ideas how that event could be documented and how people could be interviewed. What kind of questions could be asked so that people, the viewers who are watching that video, they understand what the event was about. Be it a company or a small business owner, the first thing they have to do before starting the video marketing campaign is to figure out what the final goal is for that campaign to work. If it's just to make the video because everybody else is making, it's not going to work. You have to have the strategy for your video marketing for it to help you out in your business or for your company or building the awareness about what you do and what kind of services you provide. So that is the most important thing that my clients have to do is to figure out what they want in the end out of their video or the whole video marketing strategy.